Welcome to Bellucci Zone. In today's video, we'll talk about direct and indirect objects in Bellucci language. This is a quick video, but in the next one, I'll do a longer version about subject and object pronouns. Let's dive in to this video. Starting with direct object. James bought some chocolates for Alex. James bought some chocolates for Alex. James a lahati chocolate pa Alex zort. James a lahati chocolate pa Alex zort. Or you can say James a lahati chocolate pa Alex gept. James a lahati chocolate pa Alex gept. In Baluchi, we translate boat as zort or gept. Zort or gept. I personally prefer zort, but some people prefer gept. They are both the past tense of zurag and grag. For the sake of keeping it simple, both zurag and grag can often translate as buying, taking, capturing, or even catching. Anyway, let's get back to our lesson. James bought Alex some chocolates. James bought Alex some chocolates. James a zort pa Alex lahti chocolate. James a zort pa Alex lahti chocolate. James a gept pa Alex lahti chocolate. Now let's move on to the indirects. James bought him some chocolates. James bought him some chocolates. James a lahti chocolate pa oio zort. James a lahti chocolate pa oio zort. James a lahti chocolate pa oio gept. James bought some chocolates for him. James bought some chocolates for him. James a zort pa oio lahti chocolate. James a gept pa oio lahti chocolate. James a gept pa oio lahti chocolate. 